The repaving of Rehoboth Avenue has suffered a setback. Good evening, I'm Charlie Sakaitis. Mallory Metzner has the night off. Welcome to our news at 11. We begin tonight with a project that's just not going to meet its initial timeline for completion. You might remember back in August that the city of Rehoboth announced that they plan to repave the avenue this fall. Well, you're going to be waiting a bit longer than that to see any construction. Coast TV News reporter Charles Reinert is live in Rehoboth Beach. Charles, interestingly enough, people were actually happy to hear this news today. Charlie, even though it's technically the off season, hundreds of people still go up and down Rehoboth Avenue every single day. And even though this re repaving project has been pushed back a little bit, some business owners here on the avenue are a little bit worried about how it might impact their bottom line. A view from above shows what Rehoboth Avenue looks like on a busy day. A repaving project of the avenue was supposed to start this fall, but that's now been pushed back until early 2024. Nasco Ivanov, who owns Critter Beach, thinks it's great news for businesses like his. January, February is the slowest, then March start picking up again, but uh, I believe that if they're going to do something, they should do it uh, then and not before December. The project is a team effort with the city of Rehoboth Beach and Del Dot. Public Works manager Kevin Williams says Del Dot needs a little more time before this project can begin, though he adds starting in the winter would make the job tougher. Obviously, it's harder to resurface and pave, you know, get asphalt in the wintertime, um, but maybe we can get all the uh, associated concrete work and everything else done. Uh, and then, you know, maybe in March or so, be ready to pave. So we're, we're hopeful that it's done, obviously, before the start of the new season. The good news, according to Williams, is that Rehoboth Avenue will not be closed completely while construction is underway. But any slowdown or traffic clog due to the repaving has business owners like Chad Miller worried. Consider the business owners, even the residents in town. Um, there's got to be a reason why why they need the, to repave it, but also taking consideration ourselves and we're trying to do the best that we can. The last time the avenue was repaved was 2005. A lot has changed since then, but what hasn't changed is the need to balance improving the nation's summer capital and keeping visitors, business and money moving. The Public Works Department says it's not entirely clear right now how long this project will take once this once construction eventually rolls around. I'm Charles Reiner, live on the Avenue in Rehoboth Beach, Coast TV News.